If you want to know how to make a quick car system, like a drifting car game, make sure to watch this video all the way to the end to find out how to. <laughs> Hey guys and welcome back to this brand new video on my channel. In this tutorial we're going to be making a little card game. Uh, so you can spawn in cards, well not directly spawn in cards but you can do like if you drive you're going to get money and some other things, maybe details, details, who cares. Um, so if you haven't subscribed yet to my channel make sure to do that right now. It is free and you will become an epic gamer and everyone becomes wants to become an epic gamer on my channel. Um, and if you want to become a member, click the blue join button down below on my channel. It's big, okay? If, if you miss it, then please, please go to the doctor or something. Um, further on, we can continue. First of all, you have to watch my mobile garage video. You will see it pop up on screen. Uh, please watch that first. Thank you. And I got two new monitors, so maybe more quality videos. AOC gaming monitors, but okay. So we can begin begin sorry um, you can get the Lambo out in workspace you can get it over here then you want to open it I'm gonna click on drive seat and insert a normal script like this and rename it to money tracker money tracker like that and then we can start typing a script First of all, you have to insert a number value in the in the money tracker. I'm gonna be naming it money money driven. Why not? First of all, you have to type local player, not not local player, like that. And it may become red on the line, but that's because you didn't define it. If you do this, okay, never mind. Local money driven is equals to script dot money driven. And then local velocity required. So we want to be going like 50, 50, 50 RPM or something before we can get actual money. And then local money given is equal to 10. We want to be giving our player 10 money every, every single time. Then we're going to make a function to check where is the player. If a uh, connect function hits like this. And then if hit the parent, call a find first child humanoid. Then so if there's a humanoid, we're gonna set our player to game the players, call and get player from character, hit the parent. Like this. Then we can over here type wall wait one do. So every single second this script is going to run, it's gonna execute. Then money dr uh, money driven yes not money given money driven dot value is equals to money driven dot value plus script dot parent dot velocity dot magnitude just like that a magnitude is I believe the length yep length of the vector then you can do if money driven dot value is above velocity required yes so if, if the money driven is higher than velocity required then the money driven but value is going to reset to zero and player dot leader stats dot money dot value is equals to player dot leader stats dot money dot value plus money given uh sorry about that we can go to our uh car handler then once you're in, we can type game the players, the player added, click connect function player, and local leader stats is equals to instance dot new folder with a player. Well, inside of, we're gonna insert this folder immediately in the player, and then after we can do leader stats dot name is equals to leader stats because yes, then local money. It's equals to instance dot new number value into our leader stats money dot value is equals to zero and money dot name is equals to money just like this so let's test this out already by clicking play here so we'll be directly on here 
uh, my computer is going to be like a bit laggy because it has to load in mesh. Oh, yep, there we go. A bit laggy. There we go. We get in a car. It's really loud, so I'm going to zoom out a bit before I break my ears. And it only works if you drive. As you see, we're in neutral mode. And we, if, uh, we don't get any money. If we drive 10, 20, 30, 40, etc., etc. So, as you can see, because we drive, well, you can make, like, drifting, like, well, meow. And you will see we will be getting money and money overall. So, that is a great way to make money from drifting in your car. Now, we're just going to be making a little GUI for our mobile players because, yes, they also exist. So, maybe, like, a money GUI. Make a text label in it. Uh, don't do anything with it. Set the anchor point to 0 0.5, comma, 0 0.5, enter. So it's going to be a bit offset, but okay. Then position, 0 0.5, comma, 0, comma, 0 0.2, comma, 0, maybe. No, let's not do it over there. We're going to switch it around. 0 0.2, comma, 0, comma, 0 0.5, comma, 0. So it's going to be over here, and that is perfect. Well, instead of 0 0.2, make it 0 0.1. Now... We can, you can customize it, whatever you want. You can maybe add in a uh, UI corner, so it's going to be roundish. You can make it green. I do not mind or care. Which will be inserting a local script. So local means only for you. You are the client. So we can be typing a wall through do. Wait, uh, 0 0.1. Um, script dot parent dot text is equals to game dot players dot local player dot leader stats dot money dot value and that's it so what we're doing is we're ev we're going to be executing this every single time every single uh, every single 0.1 seconds and we're setting the text to whatever the player money has so if we're testing this out real quick for playing here We got zero money. Now, if we get in our car, start it up. Takes a bit, but okay, doesn't matter. We're gonna drive. We're gonna see our money updates 10, 20, 30, and that works. We're gonna be changing one single thing. We are gonna be doing money and then space dot dot. Oh, you can do like money and then a dollar sign. So if we play the game one more time. You can see money uh, and then uh, colon zero dollars. If we play the game, if we drive, we're going to be seeing ten dollars, twenty, thirty, forty, etc. And it goes all the way up. If we set our lights on. These are all car errors. You should get a car without any errors because of these kind of cars kind of kind of suck. And then you can see we're going to get money every single time. Now what you have to do in order there if you want to do this, you can just put the Lambo. You can close everything in the Lambo and put it back into replicated storage. You can click play. And this is going to be our final testing. Mobile garage spawn and the Lambo is in front of us. You can get in. No errors for the uh, thingy. And if we drive around, we can see our money still goes up after we've even put it in a mobile garage system. So this is a quick tutorial on how to make this. If you did enjoy, do not forget to like and subscribe to my channel. And I will hope to see you all guys and all in the next video. Peace out and goodbye. <laughs>